Now, time for the finale. If you haven't watched part one, it will be linked right here, just above. First up, the Musketeer, and she's a funny one. She's got quite strong, quite strong indeed. But the most important thing is that she's got tight pink curly hair, which is very fashionable. I, ha I do like it. However, zooming in here, I did notice this happened. Oh, and for that, it's just wrong. So she gets demoted. De oh, dear. Moving on to the mad woman herself. No, not Harley Quinn, but the axe maniac. No, I mean Valkyrie. Please don't hurt me. Anyway, this ginger ninja is a wild child and she does a lot of damage. However, without her friend, she's useless as a bag of sticks. However, with that rage, God damn! Let's go in here. Up next, the archer and she's a baddie through and through. Probably one of the sassiest characters the game has and she's not to be messed with. She's got range. Barbarians, watch out. Anyway, moving on to the Witch and the Night Witch, the two sisters of the Grave and the Undead, spawning skeletons like Larry and bats like... well, bats. Anyway, I personally think they are both super strong and I would love to have them on my team any day of the week. I have an interesting one. It is the Bandit, and I'm not so sure about her. Like, she would pounce at you and you wouldn't know. That may seem cool. However, if she got angry at you, you just wouldn't see her coming. <laughs> and for that, I'm sticking her in. Nah. Up next. The one we've all been waiting for. The almighty Archer Queen. And she means business. Arguably the best hero in the game. Equipped with the, uh, the new abilities, making her super strong. Pardon me. Anyway. I just can't get enough of her. When she's upgrading her, I just wanna cry. <laughs> she is going top, top tier. Subscribe for more guys if you have enjoyed, and peace.